And we start with breaking news and a big announcement from Governor Tina Kotek. Just about two hours ago, she announced Oregon's new Secretary of State. Let's bring in Mike Benner. Mike, what have you learned about the governor's pick? Yeah, Brenda, her name is LaVon Griffin Valade. She has worked for more than a decade as an auditor for both Multnomah County and the city of Portland. It appears Griffin Valade's background, both professionally and ethically, stood out to the governor, who is meeting with reporters right now. And I want to share with you a little of what she's saying about her pick for Oregon Secretary of State. I told Oregonians back in May that the primary objective of our next Secretary of State would be to restore confidence in the office of the Secretary of State. I took my time, and after taking the time to evaluate this very critical decision, I feel strongly that LaVon griffin Valade is the right person to meet this moment and regain Oregonians' faith in their government. And all of this is necessary, of course, after the resignation of Shamia Fagan back in early May. You might recall Fagan was feeling pressure to vacate her position following revelations that she worked as a paid consultant for the owners of a troubled marijuana dispensary chain, all while overseeing a state audit on cannabis regulation. Governor Kotek called this whole thing a scandal. And after Fagan's resignation, she tapped Deputy Secretary of State Cheryl Myers to fill the role on an interim basis. Now it's Griffin Valade's job. She'll serve the remaining one and a half year term. She's slated to be sworn in on Friday of this week. We'll have more on this breaking news later this afternoon and evening. Brenda, I'll send it back to you. Absolutely. Mike Benner reporting live in the newsroom. Thank you.